Right guys, I'm um, just taking the trim off the bathroom. Um, this is just in preparation for flooring. Obviously take the trim off floor underneath and then put the, the skirting board back on. I just wanted to show you a quick tip um, when pulling nails. And you'll notice there's a lot of nails. You know, obviously once you take the trim off, you'll see it along there. Um, all the nails protrude. Um, I've just got a way that I do it. I don't know if anybody else does it. Well, maybe they do, but I just thought it was a quick tip. Normally I use uh, nail pullers like this. Um, but when you're taking nails from the reverse side, it's just, you just can't get a grip because the head of the nail isn't there. Um, the reason you take the, the nail from the reverse side is um, so you don't you don't want to damage the face of the skirt board of any unnecessarily unnecessarily filling. So you always pull the nails from the back forward. Um, so a claw hammer or a, a tool like this, a nail puller, or even a rough neck bar like this, you know, they struggle to struggle to grip the nail. So what I use, um, this is the Nipex Cobras that are, are water pump pliers for plumbing. Um, you use these all, well, I use them all the time in plumbing, um, but they're, they're really good for this, this purpose. So all you do is grab the nail like this, you know, squeeze them together, twist it, and then use the, use the curve of the, the Cobra to pull the nail. Like that. So you get the nail out, uh, but importantly you don't, you know, there's no damage on the front where the nail was. So I'll do that again. The next nail, uh, just grip it, twist it like that, and then use the, the curve of the, of the head, pull it out gently. There you go. Again, last time, <sighs> grip it, turn it, and then use the curve. Again, comes out no problem. Um, just one here, I'll see if I can get out with this, <laughs> just to demonstrate that it's, see, it just slips off. <sighs> no. Nail pull up, just pulls off, slips off, but the Cobras. Grip it, turn it, and pull. That's it, so that's all the nails out of the, the baseboard now. No damage whatsoever. So, when this is ready to fit, we just basically fit it back and brad nail it from the front. Right guys, well hopefully you found that helpful. Uh, I'll leave a link in the description to, to these um, if anybody's interested. If you like the video, please give it a like. Uh, that helps uh, promote the video. Um, Please feel free to subscribe to my channel. Uh, I will be producing a lot more tips like this in the future. Okay, thanks again, guys. Uh, it's me back to this mess here. Um, so I'll get back to this and I'll let you guys have your day. Okay, thank you.